my quality food here on the boat. Back out on the water. It's calm out today. The last two days has been super, super rough. Decided that we'd pull the cameras back out today since it's nice and calm. Um, we did actually just put a fish in the box uh, before we could even get the cameras out. We got everything set up and we had a board go back. So I'll show you guys a fish since we got a little bit of time here. Mm -hmm. um, on Monday, the fish were a little smaller. Um, but the last couple days, the fish we've been getting are a lot beefier, a lot fatter, and even a little bit longer. So um, definitely fun to catch these bigger fish. And uh, it makes good, for, makes good for a couple more fillets too at the end of the day. So. Today we were uh, pretty much running the same program we were running on Monday. Uh, we're in deeper water. We're not doing the snap weight program today though. Um, we've been finding a lot of these fish right now are up a little higher in the water column. Um, so we've kind of been able to stay away from the snap weights. Snap weights. Um, we're still running snap weights on our two inside rods. Uh, we might resort back to it a little bit later since it's so calm um, today. The fish might be hanging out a little deeper today, but uh, we just got out here, just got set up. So we're gonna figure out the program and uh, hopefully put some more fish in the boat today. So. It's gonna be a fun one. It's gonna be warm. It's gonna be nice. Really excited to start fishing. So, what do you think? Let's go catch some more, huh? Matt was just saying that there aren't no fish left here. Guess what? Outside board went. You got to say about yourself now, Matt. Don't let. Oh, dude. <laughs> what are you trying to do to us? I've learned the last few. Times. <laughs> All right. Well, you've learned just to reel in real fast, so it keeps the rod low when the bait flicks out of the water. Sure, sure, sure. It's actually not a bad fish. It's gonna stay underneath this line right here. I'm gonna back up. Matt's gonna get the net job on camera here. Ready, Andy? Yep. There he is. Nice. In the net. There he is. Nice Perfect ear. ear. Look at their fins. Beautiful, healthy fish. Awesome. Well, put that one in with the other one. The other one's got a little buddy now. Yep. Awesome. Well, that was what, I don't know how long we went there. A couple, 45, 45, minutes. 45 minutes without a fish. So the spot is uh, definitely not as productive as it, as it was yesterday. Uh, we were just talking to yesterday. We were pretty much battling three or four footers out here yesterday and it, the bite seemed to be a little better, but a lot of those fish yesterday were a lot higher in the water column than they are today. So few and far between, I don't know. We're gonna, we're gonna I think we're gonna sit this spot out a little bit yet and then maybe we're gonna go out a little deeper try some other things and uh, maybe go explore a little bit since it's a little, it's a little nicer out today so still awesome fish still an awesome time and we're gonna grind her out today and hopefully get a limit oh double what's going on boys double <laughs> Uh-oh. Oh, jeez. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. We, got, we got problems going here. Is there a fish on that? Uh, there was. There's a fish on it, yeah. Doubled up right now. Come on. Five minutes after we left you guys last time. Now we got this figured out. Now we're thinking. Now what's gonna happen is Matt is gonna step down and I can take his board off. And then, uh, yeah. Andy might have to do a little net job and we we'll get through this. We're gonna get through this together. We will. This we is are a team, team effort. Team effort here. We're starting to figure out where this small pod of fish is. It's not a very big pod, but it's not a big pod at all. No. We'll get it. We'll get all dialed in for you guys. But if we can get one or like if we can get a double or a triple or something off of every pass over it, that'd be cool. And these are quality fish. This this fish that I'm holding right now feels heavy. No, it's still there. I don't know what's going on here. You got a lot of problems going on. It's either gone or it's just, just gave up, I don't know. Hey, get away from my fish. That is a giant white bass. Uh-oh, you got a problem. I got that one. Right? Could this be the biggest fish we've seen yet on this trip? It's almost looking like it, I don't know, it's, it's water. It's a freaking donkey, dude. The water, uh... The water does make it look bigger than it is, but it looks like a freaking giant. What a pig. He's not hooked the best, dude. He's got that back treble. It seems like to be a common theme with these fish we've been getting out here. Back treble, and that's it. It is a nice one, though. 
off. You can see that, Andy. Got him. A little bit of a reach, and he's in the net. That's probably the biggest one. That's, that's the, the biggest trip. one of the trip. That is a nice fish right there. Wow. So it already came off. That was too. deep too. Oh, you guys saw it. That was a double. I had a little white. Actually, that that was a big white bass. But that right there is a dandy walleye. Nice fish. Nice fish. You should get a weight on him just to kind of give the people at home an idea. Just over six. Just over six. Yeah. That's a pretty good fish right there. Would have been an awesome double. My day. You like saying that? Look at that he done. Texas find a tall oak tree, tying all of them bad boys. Leave them high in the street. Get the mic on right. All right, now yeah. you're over the top of it now. I am? Yeah. All right, I'm just gonna bring them in then. Get them in the net. There it is. All right, that's the first one of the double. The other double's hanging out there right now. Another chunky Lake Erie walleye. These things are healthy, man. They're definitely eating well. Um, like we were seeing the other day, there's plenty of bait on the grass, so these walleyes aren't starving. That's definitely for sure. So another nice eater, though. We're going to put that in the live well because we got another fish on the outside. That makes four right now. We got four in there. 14. Going to boat flip them. That right there is a Bassmaster Classic. Boat flip. Boat flip. Boogity, 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 boys. That's a hookup. What do you think? Not a white bass this time. Tuna. Huh? Tuna. Tuna? Yeah. Just started marking them. Matt's giving me the, I don't really care anymore vibe. I got Is that a, how you're feeling? I got problems going on right now. Well, we got bigger issues. That's, that's fine. So I'll kind of explain what's going on here. We went out deep for a little bit. Um, wanted to explore, see what was out there. We didn't find too much, but a cool white bass. A walleye that we did ended up catching at the end. Um, didn't get that one on camera, but what we did is we came back in shallow. This spot's been pretty good to us the last couple days around this three o'clock time over all the way till sunset. So hopefully we can pull like a, a limit here. We got six right now on the live well, and uh, last night we caught. Why well, would we get eleven? Well, so, I've been two of them were under, or two were under. Yeah. Too bad. So there's a good chance we could uh, possibly get a limit yet tonight, which would be awesome. It would be the first one of the trip. So, especially with this kind of weather, black home days like this, I mean, sometimes that can almost be your worst day fishing. So, like Andy said earlier, can use a little wind here. <laughs> Didn't go 20. I think it wanted that bait. That right there is what we call a gravel lizard, boys and girls. Take a step back, came on that dirty reef there. The old swoop, and it's in the net. <laughs> that easy. Another nice Lake Erie walleye. You can see where he was hooked there. That, uh, that walleye definitely wasn't getting off. We got bent hooks, we're gonna have to switch that one out so we can get that bait back out, but that's a nice job, so. Anyways, it's been an awesome day already, and uh, I'm, I'm hoping it's gonna get even better here as, a, as the sun starts to get a little lower in the sky too. So, awesome day though. Lots of people out here. A lot of people are having a good time. Awesome fish. Look at there again. You can see that green stripe. Good plant of it in the sunlight there. It almost looks straight. It's so pretty. But awesome fish. Awesome time out here on Erie with the boys. Uh, caught a lot of fish the last couple of days. I know the last couple of days we weren't really able to record um, just because of the wind and audio sake. Uh, I don't want to just keep the cameras in the bag, but we were able to get some fish uh, the last few days in the wind and the waves, battle it out. And today is uh, just a good day to come out here, relax a little bit without having to rock around all over the boat and uh, still being able to put some fish in the boat. It's always a good time. So I think we're going to end on this fish. I'm going to get this one to the live well. We're going to keep fishing probably till dark and hopefully put a limit in the boat here tonight. But I don't want to make this video too long and boring for you guys. This is it. This is what we've been catching. And we were able to get a big one today for you guys too, which is pretty awesome. But other than that, I think we're going to hang this video up and uh, call, it a, call it a week. So it's been awesome to get out here. I haven't been on Erie in about two years. And uh, it's awesome to get back on this body of water. I've never come out here in the fall. Um, it definitely doesn't change. So other than that, I think it's back to Green Bay. We're going to do 
some musky fishing, some walleye fishing on the Fox River, hopefully here soon, and uh, put some put some more hurt on walleyes. So thank you guys for watching this video. If you liked it, please be sure to head down, give this video a thumbs up, comment below, let us know what you thought, and don't forget to hit that subscribe button. We'll catch you guys on the next video. Peace.